This was a nice relaxing morning. We got to lay in bed and snuggle a little bit and enjoy the sunshine coming through the windows. And Fairby decides to stretch out right here and I thought it was so cute the way that she just flopped down. In the mornings, I like to journal and write out a to-do list. That way I make sure I don't miss anything. And also it's kind of a nice way to do a little brain dump and just start the day fresh. This is not a typical morning activity, but the night before I didn't clean my kitchen, so I'm taking care of that. This morning, um, I use Method products usually or 7th generation, so this is my Method granite cleaner, and then I also have an all-purpose cleaner that I use for like the handles and knobs and things like that. I typically don't use paper towels, but because of the pandemic, I have been just so I can use them and throw them in the trash rather than keeping used dirty things inside. Anytime I sit at my desk, Fairy sits with me <laughs> in my chair. She's in the chair with me, why aren't you? Look at my tomato plants. So, we have some tomatoes going on. I'm really excited about that. Um, I haven't been buying fresh produce since the whole pandemic thing, just because I'm a little bit worried about that. So, yeah. Well, I've bought it a little bit, but you know, I'm trying to limit how much I go out. So obviously you can't buy fresh produce, um, you know, and have it last for a super long time. So I have some tomatoes growing. I have a few different types of lettuce growing in my air garden. And I tried to start up a couple of tomato plants, but it doesn't look like anyone's doing good, except for maybe those two are gonna come up, but they're not really doing great. They're just kind of there. And I put more lettuce over here. Because those are the things I miss the most, is lettuce and tomatoes. And then I have some basil over here. So that's what we've got. And I'm going to go 
take my plant. So this is a holiday cactus. I don't know if it's an Easter cactus or a Christmas cactus or what. Um, my granny says Easter, but then someone else said it's Christmas. So that. And I don't know what this is either, but it's some type of succulent that does really good. Um, I've had it for a really long time. So we decided to go somewhere. We're gonna go for a little drive. We might get out and walk in a parking lot or something. We have stray dogs in our neighborhood and I'm really afraid that they're gonna attack us. So I don't feel comfortable walking in here right now. So I think we're gonna maybe just try to go like find an empty parking lot to walk in. I don't know. Oh, we see, I know we can go home. Are you excited? After our drive, we ended up walking around in the neighborhood. Um, I never found a parking lot that I felt like it would be appropriate to get out in. So we just didn't. And I'm filing Farabee's nails. We always wear masks and cover her ears so it's not loud and so I don't breathe in dust. I'm amazed at how much dust you actually get on your floor whenever you have no carpet or rugs. At the other house, we had some carpet and I guess that cut down on it. Oh, and Farabee doesn't shed, so it's not like it's her hair everywhere. It's just, I guess, hairs and dust particles from the world. So on my stairs, I have Edison bulbs, and the ones I have have stars inside, and they're battery powered. I will link them for you guys below if you're interested. Meals are getting weird. So the night before I had black eyed peas and something. So I had leftover black eyed peas, but I mixed them with some Mexican seasoning, cheese, and some tomatoes that I still had fresh. And of course, just kind of made a little quesadilla situation. It was actually really good. Um, I would have not normally used black eyed peas for that, but it turned out good. Therapy still likes to be carried up the stairs at night like a baby, so I love it and I take advantage of that and I'll do it as long as she lets me.
So that's our day. I hope you enjoyed spending the day with us and we will see you soon. Bye guys. Thank you.